What the? Alrighty guys, Mark Delama here with another unwrapping for you guys. And this time I got Need for Speed Payback. This steelbook was an only at Best Buy exclusive steelbook. All you had to do was pre-order it and you'll get the steelbook. I heard uh, quite a bit of mixed reviews. Uh, some of them were not so good. Some of them were like, yeah, it was, it was okay. A few of them were good. I have to judge it for myself. So, of course, I had to pick it up. And it had a steelbook, so you guys already know. As soon as I get more playtime, I'm going to do my own review on my Instagram and Twitter. So if you guys want to check that out, I'll leave the link to those in the description. Anywho, let's get started with the unwrapping. Alrighty, now that I got the wrapping out the way. Yeah, I know it's in two different cases, which I actually prefer it this way. So that way you can get the regular box, well, the case, and the steelbook separate, which is pretty cool. Uh, usually when they do it through pre-orders, like if you get the steelbook just for pre-ordering, it's usually separate. But anywho, yeah, I'm going to open these both up, check it out. Let's go ahead and uh, check this out first. So here's the front. Is it the same? Oh, yeah, it's the same. I didn't even notice. Oh. Okay, yeah. So here's the front of the case, standard case, spine, back. So here are some screenshots of the game, which looks really good. So I'm really disappointed that there is some negative reviews on there, which suck because I was really hoping this would be great. But like I said... I gotta review it for myself, so I'm just gonna go in there with an open mind. Look at that, that looks pretty clean. Alright, so it is one player, 45 gigabyte minimum, 48 online, DualShock 4, and online play optional, which is good because I really do not like. I'm okay, I'm not a big fan of online only games. And the last Need for Speed I liked, I was just not a fan of that online only. And uh, PS4 Pro Enhance, please, all these new games have that Xbox One X Enhanced or whatever, and PS4 Pro Enhance. We got the new systems out, make it for those new systems. And it is rated T for language, mild suggestive themes, and mild violence. Okay, let's go ahead and open it up. What the heck is this? It's an advertisement, what is this for? Oh, it's for like a clothing line or something. If you guys want to keep that, there you go, have that. And here is the disc, Need for Speed Payback. Still can't wait to jump in this game. Okay, close that. Now let's check out the steelbook. Okay, it's not glossy. It's like that matte finish, which is nice, but it does have that shine, that holographic shine on Need for Speed and the cars. Oh, all the cars, that is pretty clean. Check that out. Nice. Really clean. Here's the spine. Need for speed payback. EA logo there. Ghost logo there. And the back. Oh, that's pretty cool too. Look at that. You have to move it so you can see it clearly. That's cool. I like that. It's got the red and the dark red. Need for speed payback. Open it up. Oh, man. That's actually pretty cool. That car got hit. Oh, Nice. Let's, there you go. Get a better shot. It's kind of hard with the glare, but you guys can get the gist of it. Graphics look really good. If this is a screenshot of the game or the cinematic, I don't know. It looks pretty good. Oh, there's another car right there too. Crazy. And there's a steelbook logo right there. Pretty clean. I like the front and the back and the inside. That is nice. This is a solid eight. Steelbook's a solid eight. The game. We have to wait to find out. But I want to know what you guys think. Have you played this game? Did you guys pick it up? Did you get this edition or did you get a different edition? Let me know in the comments. If you guys like this video or like this steelbook, go ahead and click the like. If you guys want to see more videos, go ahead and subscribe. Make sure you turn on those notifications so you don't miss out on any upcoming videos or giveaways that I do. And for all other things that I post, check out my other social networks like my Instagram and Twitter. I'll leave the link to those in the description. Thanks for watching. Until next time.